Chapter 6, Parametric DC Sweep, we'll go over how to perform a DC sweep of a global parameter and to determine the maximum power transfer. In this circuit, we will demonstrate the power dissipation in the resistor R2. This is a power transfer display. We set up the circuit first with a 10 volt voltage source is DC, two resistors R1, 1K, and R2, which is initially set to 1K as well. Next, we add in the grounds for the circuit. This is a zero volt reference point. And we change the voltage value to 10 volts VDC. And now by clicking on the 1K value for R2, we will change the value to a variable resistor using the RVAL command in brackets. Next we'll add the part param. This is a parameters function for we're going to be using for R2. Double click on that, click new column, type in the name RVAL and the value 1K for this example and then click OK once you've done that. Now select it and click display and then select the button name and value and click OK and then exit out of the properties window. Now we want to node name the circuit the V in as well as a V out so we can capture these things in our simulation waveform window. Now we're ready to set up our simulation profile using the DC sweep for analysis and selecting the parameter name is R eval. The start value is 1, end value is 10k with an increment of 10. Now we're ready to run the circuit and from the waveform that's generated we can easily see a peak and the power dissipation so we select our power using the formula which is V out times current of R2 and as we can see the power increases and then it dissipates at a much slower rate from its peak. And this is dependent on the value of R2 anywhere from 0 to 10k ohms. And that there is the basics for a parametric DC sweep.